So I got a new bag. I was going to do an unboxing, but I was really excited because I've been waiting on it for like 10 days. And it finally came. I ordered it like 10 days ago. And a uh, little bit of a story. I was, I hate messenger bags. I do. I prefer backpacks. But backpack really wasn't doing what I needed it to do as far as holding the stuff that I bring with me to work. Plus I bought a laptop Black Friday. And uh backpacks when I'm when I got my winter clothes on, you know, it's Florida, so it ain't that cold. But I got layers on. And it's hard to get a backpack strap <laughs> over your shoulder when you got jackets and all kinds of stuff on. So I was looking at messenger bags and I'm like, okay, I got two options. You can buy the expensive one. It'll be nice and I know it'll be nice, but it'll be expensive. Or I can do the right thing and I can save money and just buy something cheap off Amazon. It'll probably be fine. So I did the right thing. I bought something cheap off Amazon. It's this Vox Vonxery messenger bag off Amazon. It was like 30 or 40 bucks. It's kind of nice, you know, considering the fact. If you want me to do a review on this, uh, just put it down in the comments if you'd like to see me do a review on this. There wasn't too many when I looked, so I might do one. I don't know if y'all want to see something like that. But it's okay, but you know what I did as soon as I ordered this? I regretted not buying the expensive one. So I carried this around for about a day, maybe two. And I was like, I'm just going to go ahead and buy the expensive one. You know what they say, buy once, cry once. So I got a Chrome Brand 3, I think it's called, messenger bag. So what we're going to do right now is we're going to see how the stuff in my other bag fits in this one. This one ain't got quite the pockets that the other one's got, but I think everything's going to fit in there pretty good. So I've already put two things in there because I put two things in there and I thought, hey, I should record this. It makes some decent content, I guess. So what I got in here already is my water bottle from 3V Gear that I've had for like five, six years. I just wanted to see if it would fit in this pocket here, which ain't really a pocket technically. But it fits. It fits. And then I wanted to see if my traveler's notebook would fit in this pocket. And it does. Of course, I don't have the pin loops for it yet. Once I put the pin loops on it, it won't fit. So I'm not sure if I'm going to do that or not. But it fits. So let's see what else fits in there. What else do I have in this bag? Let's go ahead... We'll do the laptop last because that might make it fall over. Let me pop these snaps. Put that on up. So we'll start with this pocket here. Which I have this and this. We're going to do a review of this at some point. The Ernest Hemingway notebook. I think that's all I have in here. Yeah. That's all I got in there. This is what I write short stories in. And this is just my catch-all uh, little notebook here. I put my thoughts and I guess some people call it a commonplace book. I guess that's the term for it. But I got... Uh, videos I watched on YouTube about how to make better YouTube videos and I write it in here I was watching a video last night on how to write a book how to get started writing a book because I want to write a book and it's not how it started it's not how this notebook started but that's how it is uh, at the moment it started off as just me needing to get stuff out of my head and I just put it in here and write down ideas, the way I was feeling, poem ideas, my mountain vlog video that I did on my other channel, Wretches and Wrenches, which was not called that when I did that video. 
Uh, I wrote this, the uh, outline for it uh, in here. So this is kind of just whatever I feel like I need to write down real quick. I put in there. And this is from a short stories. Talk about that later. But these, they might fit in here. I know one of them would. I don't know if both of them will. Hmm. Let me see. You know. Maybe one of them in here. Maybe this one in here. And this one in here. Maybe. Obviously, we're just going to set this up today however I see like it'll work. And maybe after using it for a few days, I'll come up with new new ideas. I will check the main pocket. I'm not going to pull it up here because it's kind of work out. My traveler's notebook from Galen Leather. Uh, this is where I keep my YouTube stuff that uh, I ain't hipped up with too well the last week or so. But we're going to do a video on that too. <laughs> how some of my plans and how I was going to use my journals is not working out so far this year. But uh, some of them are, not all of them. But I guess we'll shove this one. In the main pocket there. Uh, my daily planner. I talked about uh, whatever that last video was I did. My New Year's writing video, whatever. I don't remember what it was called. So we'll just show that in. This don't have no pockets inside other than this walk. But well, this ain't really a pocket either. I said that already. But it's basically just one big pocket in the middle but it's got this waterproof lining that keeps everything dry uh in my poetry notebook which i haven't shown you all the cover for because last time i showed it the cover hadn't come yet but this is the cover it's got the pin loop on the front snaps got a Lloyd's charm in there uh soft cover that i write my poems in and this one's getting pretty scuffed up in that bag there but you know that's what leather's supposed to do right character they call it so we'll put this in here somehow so I guess that works and I ordered a Kindle so we'll put that in here when it gets here Saturday. Let's see what else we got. I think the rest of it. Power cord for my uh, laptop. That'll probably shove down in there somewhere. Put that on the bottom. Put that on the top. Now I think all that's left is odds and ends and uh, my laptop. Thought I had more than this. Some earbuds. I'm thinking these, this will go in here, maybe. Kind of a tight fit. And a spare cartridge for a pen that I don't even carry. Strangely enough. <laughs> and fingernail clippers. I believe that's it. Forgot my mouse. We'll just drop that down in there too with the power cord. Totally forgot about this. My pistol. <laughs> now the main attraction, which doesn't go in this pocket. It's got Velcro. That's what I like. I like that about it. Turn it around. Man, there's plenty of room for that thing in there. I think this will hold up to a 17 inch laptop. Mine's 15. There we go. She's happy. 
but everything that was in the other one is in here. So, we'll go ahead and snap it. And uh, let me get y'all set up so y'all can see how this strap system works. So it has this seat belt mechanism and it's not a strap like a regular messenger bag that just goes from the top of the bag over to the other side of the top of the bag this one's meant to go across your back so let me just clip that jack up my glasses and there you go when you can adjust it pull this pull this up and you pull that to adjust it tighter but it's tight enough the way it is and it's also got this strap that comes up under here I have to give it some slack and snaps in under your thing so it's almost like well this company makes things for actual like bicycle messengers people that actually deliver things on their bicycle I guess that's how they started so it's designed for people that you know they're riding the bike they got it strung across the back so it's kind of like the best of both worlds. It's a messenger bag, but it's kind of like a backpack. You kind of wear it like a backpack. So, pretty happy with it. We'll see about how everything fits together. But so far, maybe I'll carry it around for a couple weeks. And then I'll come back and give you an update on how it's going. As much as I paid for this, I better love it. <laughs> Even if I don't love it, I'm going to have to make myself love it. <laughs> but anyway, thanks y'all for stopping by and checking out my bag. I just felt like turning the camera on real quick and recording my new bag because I was excited about it. And uh, what are you keeping your bag? Let me know in the comments. See y'all later.